Whether it's the sound of a garbage truck or loud music at night, Vancouver residents have the chance to sound off on their noise concerns. The city says it's an important opportunity to create a balance between promoting the liveliness of our city and respecting quiet spaces. Where can we look at providing opportunities for, for more noise, uh, for outdoor festivals, for music related events? Uh, for arts and culture, uh, economic growth opportunities. And where are areas that we need to look at for them to consider maybe making it a quieter area? The city of Vancouver has received 29 noise complaints so far this year just regarding the use of leaf blowers, causing a complete ban on the use of leaf blowers in the West End. Residents we spoke to have mixed feelings on the noise. I live down by the lagoon, Stanley Park Lagoon, and they're planning a major rip-up project there that is going to drive us all out of our buildings. And there doesn't seem to be, noise control does not seem to be an issue uh, in their project. Especially in the summertime. We should be able to express ourselves and live very, very fun, as long as we're respecting other, each other's lives as well too. There are a lot of noisy vehicles, particularly this corner is almost unbearable in the well, all day long really you just saw trucks motorcycles it's just it's unbelievable the bylaw was created in 1989 and the city says it's in need of some major upgrades so now is the opportunity for us to really understand what uh, residents feel about the bylaw what uh, what needs updating what do they like about it what have we missed uh, and really modernize and and look for opportunities to enhance our noise bylaw under the current bylaw, commercial vehicles are exempt from noise pollution regulation and businesses are allowed to receive deliveries 24-7, including holidays. The online survey closes at the end of this month and recommendations will be brought to council in the fall. Yasmin Gandam, CBC News, Vancouver.